Previously on Final Fantasy VII Remake Integrate. <gasps> Wait, no, not this one. This fucking one. Oh my God, it's music. Oh my God, it's so beautiful, dude. It's so fucking beautiful. Oh, touch it, Yuffie. Touch the door. And now back to the rest of my childhood. Hello. Sneak a bee. Back with some more Final Fantasy VII Remake Integrate. When we last left off, we finally got to meet Yuffie in Remake Edition, and she's already a lot better than original Yuffie. I'm already liking her a lot. Yeah, obviously she's adorable, right? Just the alpha and everything. And she's still got the same spunky attitude that the other one did, but I don't know. It seems it's a lot more endearing this time around. Um, one of you guys actually points something out that I think is actually a good point to make. Um, that was uh, Oro Taku, who last episode said, uh, Yuffie in OG Final Fantasy VII was rather underdeveloped due to her being completely optional, though it was still more than Vincent got by a long shot. Ever since, though, her appearances in the compilation material and other series helped characterize her more appropriately and made her a much more popular fan favorite. You're right. You're absolutely right. I kind of forgot about that. Technically, Yuffie in the original game is not required. In fact, when I first played through Final Fantasy VII, and let me make, make clear, by the way, Final Fantasy VII was my first RPG, all right? I didn't understand how this shit worked. I never got Yuffie, but I did run into her, because the thing in the original game is that you would run into her as a random encounter in certain areas. Um, and then afterwards, a cutscene would play, and then you had to make the right choices, otherwise she would, like, steal your money or run away. And I just kept thinking she was just like this random annoying enemy that just stole my money and stuff. I didn't realize I could actually recruit her. So I went through the entire game without knowing that. And it wasn't, I think, until years later when it was like, I, I think I looked up something online about like cheats or whatever. And it brought up like, oh, yeah, this is how you recruit Yuffie. And I'm like, what? Who? Huh? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, uh, though, to be perfectly honest, even when I did finally recruit her, like go back and replay the game, I like never used her. I always found her incredibly annoying, but also just there were other characters that I'd rather use in fights. It wasn't actually until I went and did that, uh, I streamed the uh, Final Fantasy VII game with all those mods uh, added to it that I actually finally used Yuffie. That was like, that was the playthrough I actually started using her. It's actually pretty good though. She actually has some, some pretty good moves, at least in that version of the game. But yeah, that's a good point. It's because she is optional, it's hard to sort of include her in cutscenes without, you know, maybe changing the flow of the story. So it's more just like, if she does get anything to say in a cutscene, it's usually just kind of like a, re a response to something, a reaction, right? But yeah, and maybe that's the other reason why I find it more endearing now is because I, I did like Yuffie from like Kingdom Hearts and stuff. I think she was a lot more of an interesting and fun character, uh, which I think is what they were tending to go for anyway in the original. It just didn't come across super well. Uh, but Orotaku, thank you so much for that, uh, honestly, enlightening and eye-opening uh, comment. And it is for that reason you are comment of the day. But yeah, I've been dying to get back into more of this game, honestly. I'm like, I'm a little, like, I want to get through this game really quickly just so I, I don't risk spoilers. Because <laughs> people are going to blaze this game super fast, right? Because I, I don't, or this DLC, I mean, because I don't think it is super long. So I'm just kind of like, I don't know, slightly nervous because... I don't want to show up in my, you know, relevant videos. I mean, be fair, this isn't any different than any other Let's Play at the same time. But the thing is, when a game is relatively long, it takes a varying amount of time for a lot of people to complete it. If it's short, though, and people get to the end really fast, that means that a lot more people are going to be posting videos of that ending than otherwise. So, and because that ends up happening all at once, YouTube algorithms like, oh shit, everybody wants to watch this, better put it on somebody's relevant stuff. So I might have to like turn off my related videos maybe or something for a while must avoid uh but anyway we spent pretty much all last episode i swear to god we had like two, a couple of fights at the start and then we came here and just played the shit out of fucking four condor which i will say is already better than the original four condor in every way humanly possible um i actually don't think i, I was thinking that oh god this entire let's play is gonna be this but I, uh, I think it's just going to be confined to this area, this town. I think once we leave here, we're not going to be doing any more Four Condor stuff. Um, but this is clearly their way of sort of filling out the game a bit, right? Because I do think uh, probably by itself, if you just go straight through the story, it's probably not going to take too long. Um, all right, I got some additional stuff. So let's see if I can beat Wedge this time. I'm going to show you Wedge. Is he like the supreme dude? I don't think he is. I have a distinct feeling the guy who like taught me how to play the game is gonna be like the the ultimate dude, right? The super four condor lord. Um. All right. So what other boards? So I got. Oh yeah, assassin assassin board two, which is good. But battalion board is nice because it gets a lot of really good skills. It's one of the ones I bought with with haste. 
cure barrier this this shit's all fucking good yeah i think i'm gonna go with i'm gonna go with that because i also get more units too um all right so he's got two red dudes three green dudes and three blue dudes i'm actually sort of noticing too when i went back and edited last episode i realized that there is actually i think a use even for the the uh the weaker dudes because you it allows you to make more of them at once right you get one super beefy guy but if you make just a whole bunch of little dudes that can overwhelm them with numbers at least potentially though if they end up having dudes that can do area effects um it might knock those up those guys out pretty quickly i don't know it's actually a fair amount of uh tactical thought that goes into this that i do appreciate all right yes the slug ray facility that is super good i can also see the potential of just honestly having a lot of barracks <laughs> if you just like lay down a holy shit ton of barracks that could be pretty good maybe or it could be total trash i think one or the other all right let's uh give it a try damn the area effect on that move jesus Give him a barrier. Holy shit, that did some fucking damage. All right. Oh my God, this fucking helicopter. Oh my God, dude. You fucked up. Okay. Uh, Yeah, no, I changed my mind. Some of these are too many. Too many barracks is actually not good. I've got an army. Push ahead. Uh. Kick his ass. Oh my God, I got so many dudes. Keep pushing. Ah, I get fucked. Oh, baby, that pressure's built up. Oh, come on. Fuck this thing up. Urgh. I'm gonna make a dude. I'm gonna make a, one of these two. How about that? It's all right. Destroy one of your towers, bitch. I still win, motherfucker. Ah, die, witch. It's kind of like nice there's a time limit. Otherwise, these, these could potentially go on for a long time. Not gonna lie. I didn't think you had a chance. Sure showed me. That's right, eat shit. You freaking bet I did. Aw, not gonna go crying to your cats, are ya? Aww. <laughs> You've got your work cut out for you, my furry friends. Battalion Board 3, nice. Rank 4 players. Uh, is that the final one? Oh. Chadley? Uh oh fuck it is. God damn it, Chadley. Hello, Yuffie. I finished reviewing your Fort Condor match records. You exhibit what in sporting parlance is called the ability to perform in the clutch. Yeah, and clutch. The heart of a champion. The heart of the cards. In combination, these traits make you the ideal player. That being the case, if it isn't too much trouble, would you mind testing your medal against me? Uh I can't. Well, so. fuck you up, dude! I'm sure you'll kick butt. Oh wait, 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 that reminds me. That is most Yes, hurting. shut up, shut up. I I I meant to just I realized it when I was editing last episode. I didn't fucking upgrade my weapon at all. Even though I've got points. Silly Billy. Alright, what we what we got? Uh attack plus three. AP up. Oh wow, that's uh quite good. Allows you to use mug? What? That's interesting. Uh 250. HP. Uh, wow. That's super cool. Wait, so I even need the seal ability? Oh, but it's only if I equip this weapon though, right? I'm guessing it's like what it was in the original. Like I'll, I steal something, but also attack. Uh, increased AP just sounds super good. All right. What about the boomerang? Uh, attack plus three magic attack plus six attack damage. 5% boost thievery again. Is this a different one or no, it's the same thing. Okay, so I get mug on this one too. Uh, Shuriken Master, uh, AP up again, precision defense barrier. Increases the amount of time throwing stars can remain aloft. So like my, no, that's my ninjutsu, right? Oh, it, yeah. So how long, when I, throw tr when I throw it with triangle, how long will it hang in the air and I can cast ninjutsu? Yeah. Uh, precision defense barrier. Guard gets an attack at the right time to to cast barrier. Oh, that's kind of dope. That's just super dope. Can I assume you're ready to do? Battle? Yes, I am ready to do battle. Okay, this battalion board three was very good. Oh fuck, he is the grand master board. Oh shit, it is him. It is fucking Chadley. I thought for sure it was gonna be my tutorial guy. Like it turns out he was holding back and he was actually a god. Wow, it's interesting. It doesn't allow for very many um pieces. 
but he gets max speed and uh well yeah max speed actually it doesn't even allow for like the like anything higher than a level five piece too so it seems super limited but i'm guessing this is still gonna be pretty tough oh it does get the ability to stop too um all right okay so i think having just barracks is a bad idea i mean you could build up enough dudes but um, they have enough beefy guys, they'll just blow up your barracks before you get any units. So you gotta have guys, like, backing them up. Oh, I got the Armored Shock Trooper, too. That guy's very good. Alright, let's give it a shot. Time to die, Chadley! Okay, he's building- oh my god, he's building a fuck ton of barracks around me. But I got my own dudes over here, motherfucker! I also got a barracks making a bunch of guys. Come here, armored trooper. Get over there. Get fucked. Get out of here. Die, demon. Yeah, push both sides. Push both sides. Ah. Uh. Cutter. Yeah. Yeah. Die, Tadley. Die. Die, Tadley. Ah, ha, ha. More power. Need more fucking power. Got a fucking army, Chadley. You should have known your place. Oh, God, they're going to stop. Uh. Yeah, fuck him up, blue dude. That's right. He's not dead yet. I was actually right. He's actually his class changes, too, when his, his uh, armor dies. He goes from blue to red. This helicopter is fucking durable, I, I gotta say. Oh my god, he's just putting barracks, like, right next to each other. Okay. Now this part's gotta survive. God, his ATV builds up so fast, though. Holy crap. Uh, oh, babe, we good. We good. Oh, yeah. Your reign ends here, Chadley. I'm the new Grandmaster. Ooh, AP up materia. Good lord, AP up weapons and AP up materia? Well, slap my thighs. That was quite the performance, Yuffie. Thanks to you, my hypothesis has been substantiated. Now you're supposed to be pissed. Your hypothesis what now? Substantiated. I was testing security measures against Wutaian espionage operations. By offering a reward, I surmised I could accelerate the rate of adoption, which would, in turn... Yeah, yeah, skip to the end. Give me my shit. Oh, uh, I, guess, I guess Stingley was the AP up materia. What I meant to say was this. The money and the materia are yours. Do with them as you please. Did you say materia? So, you're the Grandmaster. Who'd have thunk? Ha ha ha! How does it feel, Shinra, to see the whole of Midgar brought to its knees by the amazing Yuffie? <laughs> Your capacity to remain undeterred and overcome adversity is commendable. You are truly a worthy competitor. Too bad you must when die I now. <laughs> hypothesis, I would be honored if you would agree to kick its butt. Anytime. <sighs> Game set master. Hey, all right. That was fun. That was a fun little aside. Nice little mini game. I'm sure there's probably, uh, uh, you probably go back and, oh, hey, I see one of those poster things. Oh, I see. The songs are supposed to indicate when you're getting close to, uh, one of these things. Um, but I'm betting, betting on what the heck? Well, hello, doggo. I'm betting the, uh, don't let the dog notice you? Why? What's... Why would I want him to notice me? Oh, he just barked at me. But I bet, I'm guessing once you... There's probably a hard mode for this, too, right? Where you go back through just like the original game. And I bet you can play, play them again, but even harder this time, right? And maybe get more cards and boards. That'd be pretty fun. Must sneak up on Doggo. <laughs> little dog. He's like, where'd they go? I heard something. I know you're there, Yuffie. Go to sleep, Doggo. Go to sleep. Dude, you gonna lie down? There you go. Oh, God. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Just what do you think you're doing, young lady? Ah! Oh, that's what why she—that's exactly. what she was talking about with the Better dog before. Who are you? I 
talked to you before earlier. The nice people at the Happy Turtle ripping down their flyers. Are you one of them? Mm-mm. So you're trying to sneak a peek at the Merc? Not that I blame you. Always easy on the eyes. I'll give him that. But cut your losses, honey. Unless you like your men silent and emotionally unavailable. <laughs> built a wall around himself so damn high, even he can't see over it. He'll never tell you what he's thinking. And that attitude of his. A I don't know what you're talking Woody, about! Listen, Woody? I'm really not here for whoever he is. Not what yet. What are you here for? For, uh, directions. But I'm all good now. Thanks. <laughs> You know, it's funny why, again, I feel like it's a very, like, it's not very obvious whether someone's coming to rip down their posters or just take the thing that's literally right underneath it. That's part of the fucking competition that the guy set up. Maybe somebody got confused and thought what I thought, and that you had to take the entire poster with them. I don't know, maybe to make your rules clear enough, old man. You think of that? Man, I seriously... Oh my god, it's so lame! Get over it, Kyrie, God. Go back to being on Tamaki and being at my party and helping me kick ass. Well, how appropriate that I wish to run into you here. Well, that's a great attack by the ghost again. Okay, so I need to get uh, five in total, I think, for these posters. I think I've gotten three. Oh, 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 another one's totally over here. This is what the purpose, of, this is what the purpose of this area was. Yes. This goofy ass era. That, and that's what the jukeboxes are indicating is where one of these is. Mr. Kitty, you come here. Mr. Kitty. Different cat. Mr. Kitty, where'd you go? They're they're fighting over it. Turf war! Nope. That's the wrong cat. There's fat kitty. I wanna approach you. Chunky kitty. Nope. Got the wrong cat. Cats like you better not touch that shish kebab, alright? You're gonna lose that hand, girl. Uh, no, not you. There it is. Mr. Kitty, this belongs to me. Mr. Kitty, how many times are you going to get in trouble, all right? Every one of these let's plays, you always show up and you always mess up things. No, oh, don't give me those eyes, all right? Don't give me those eyes. It's not going to work on me. Not this time. <laughs> gotcha. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Cat got rabies. Don't get me. Flyer acquired. <laughs> Okay, I think I should know where the last one is. I think I remember where another jukebox is. It's near where uh, Roche is. Yeah, over here. Hey, over here. The I don't hell? Believe those freaking morons! They damn near got themselves eaten trying to hide that stupid poster. You stay away from that factory, you hear? The place has monsters coming out of the walls. Ah oh, shit! They stuck it in a fucking factory. I'm going in. You can't stop me. Unless, oh, wait, what? It's just. Right there? Gotcha. You thought you could hide from me, didn't ya? That's it, isn't it? Yeah. I think so. Wait. I've never seen a soldier up close before. Oh. Wait. Is that the sound of Oh no, never mind. What the fuck? Are these like all renditions of the Happy Turtle song? It's like some hardcore rock, super metal version of Happy Turtle song. Damn. So, okay, that's what these are. Like, that's what I was still like, okay, but then why did they do this? Why are they just like random jukebox? They aren't. They're, they're the same, well, supposedly the same song, but in done in different uh, styles. Yeah! Oh, kick the shit out of that box. <laughs> yeah, yeah, turtle shells, you can ass sucking dick. Oh, yeah! Damn, hardcore. Hardcore turtle music. <gasps> I see a rat. A rat, a rat, a furry and full on. Oh, wait, wait, let's go ahead and, uh. Gotta assess. Uh. Yeah! All right, these, uh, I'm not even gonna read this. We, we've run to these guys a billion times before. They just ra oh wait, no, these are Toxorax rats. Oh wait, there were, there were two different rats. Damn it. One was a Toxa rat and the other was a regular rat. Damn it, they look so similar. <gasps> Mr. Kitty, what are you doing in that picture with the Mr. Bird? 
Oh, that, that bird about to die today. That's a dumb bird. Die What in the fuck, dude? Oh, God. Mail your face. Oh, boy. Ah. God damn, man. You'd be so much fucking fun to control. Uh, seahorse monsters for dark, dark, moist places. Giggity. And feed on the blood of living creatures. They their prey through vibrations and temperature changes. Oh, that's right. When they start spinning, you can interrupt them. If you don't, they'll fuck you up. Ow. Oh, wait. Also, use your ability so you're not... Let's go ahead and use my, uh, ice and jutsu. Yeah. God damn, man. So cool. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, she sings the theme too, just like Barrett. I want to see now. I want to see her and Barrett getting a fight together. And have them both do the theme together. Claude and Tifa are like, oh my god, please. <laughs> hey, I like this girl. Hell yeah. Suck on this. Yeah, suck on this. <laughs> Damn it. Wait, wait. Hold on. I'm running. I need to switch my, uh, my, switch my weapon. Oh, fuck. There's a big angry dude down there. This move sounds kind of cool. Brumal form. So put this on here, which increases the AP earned, but also du this arm doubles my AP, but then I also have an ability on my weapon that, double that increases my AP. That's some good shit. Oh, hey, I unlocked a new, uh, a new node here. Uh, attack plus four, match attack power plus four, attack damage, 5% boost, steal success rate up, new material slot. Oh God, new material slot is always, it's always good. Always need it. Uh, success rate. That's pretty cool and appropriate. Uh, nothing new on this one yet. Oh yeah, so mug. Steal for, from a foe while attacking them. Can use while airborne. Dope. Yep, that's exactly what I thought it was. Actually, I should put that on a put that on a hockey here. <laughs> Could you say gonna get fully wrecked? Oh god. Okay, these guys are weak to ice. Subspecies of uh, grass, grass stripe, uh, which is, that is marked with yellow and black pattern as carapace. This also contains a highly potent poison, because of course it does. I like how you, you toss your weapon, and then if you want to go to grab it, you leap towards it. That's pretty cool. Ow. Evade attack. That's cool. So you just. If you time it right, like you're about to get by something, that's when you do it. Oh, nothing to steal. Oh, come on. Woo! Oh, God. Ow! Oh, these motherfuckers and their sleepy bullshit. I need to kill one of these guys. They're fucking me up. No! No! God damn it, this fuckers! Stupid sleeping bullshit! Ah, oh, wow, this this game, this DLC is not fuck around. It really doesn't. You are Yuffie and you are alone and afraid. At least at the start here. Oh my god, I can fucking juggle this guy. I love it. It's just if you hold the button down, you do the. You actually do a different move. So like you, you hold it, you do this, or you can rapidly press it for just like, m like bits of damage here, like this. Yes, juggle them in the air, motherfucker. Fuck this guy up. Oh, uh -huh, did you see that shit, motherfucker? See that death dodge? Oh, that's de that broom form is very good to have on a hotkey. Yeah, like that. And I get ATV back when I do it, too. I'm about to die. Oh, God. Can poison kill me? No, but 
No. Clear this out. All right. There we go. All right. That guy's dead. Oh, yeah, baby. God damn, man. So cool. Did that not count? Okay. Come on, hit me, bitch. Try and hit me. See what happens. Come on. See what happens. Haha! -ha. And poop goes the ninja. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, I am keeping this shit on for certain. Oh shit, I still got hit by it. Oh my god, come on, this fucking poison bullshit, man. Fuck! I just and I learn it, and then I have to learn it again. Oh, baby! Hit them both! Oh, god, dickhead, I'm dying of poison, but I'm just not gonna stop you from killing you! Oh, I feel great. Feel completely fine. Totally not dying at all. I need some fucking antidotes, man. And actually, now I think about it, I probably get some cleansing material while I'm at it. Uh, what we got? First strike! Chakra level up! <laughs> Hell yeah! Let's do it! Oh, I see some yellow shit. More chakra! Where the fuck is this poster? Did I run by it by accident? Oh, hey, here we go. I'm probably gonna end up running across this later, but fuck it, I'm buying it now anyway. This poison is pissing me off. Same with barrier. Oh, this is gonna be right here, right? Oh. Nope, but, uh... <gasps> Mono drive range? Dope! I did just finish that minigame, but it's still dope. Thanks, Stamp. You always point me in the right direction for that sweet booty. I can just point where the fuck the poster is. I'm hearing the rock and music, but where the fuck is the actual poster to, to rip down? Is it over here and I just missed it? Oh, it is! Didn't even see it. I ran... I was like, I kind of figured the strongest guys would be guarding it. And that makes six. Won't old snapper be impressed when I rock up with these bad boys? Oh, I oh, that's right. I forgot to have that in here. I love it. I love that they have this ability. What a quality of life that is to be able to just jump back to the quest giver. Um, is there actually anything to like look at with these? Oh, it does say something different. Want to kiss your troubles goodbye? Tired of being hung out to dry? Our sweet little ha haven is your getaway because every day is us well, that's a holiday. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna read all these. <laughs> They're all just goofy things to get everybody to come there. Gotcha. Well, well, well. Look what the tide washed in. That's a one, two, three, and a four, five, and I can't believe it. A six. We have a winner. Three cheers for the happy trails of Calgary Champions. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God, it's right in my ear. <laughs> Happy turtle. Only these Midgarian dummies would find that a challenge. Speaking of yeah, which, this yeah. fucking mutant thing's gonna would stop me. The chow beans. Does this mean what I think it does? Yes, I have teeth of steel. Well, what do you know? A real life ninja paying old snapper a visit. Truth be told, I'd love to have you around to the bar, but you got your hands full. <laughs> Not to mention the whole underage thing. Still just a youngin, I suppose. Ninja though you are. Well, I don't plan on moving from Midgar anytime soon, so once your shell's seen a bit more wear and tear, make sure to come on back. I'm 45! We'll Bullshit! Side of Wutai. Only the best for you. <gasps> oh, baby, I got the fucking magnified material. That was definitely worthwhile. Turtle-tastic! The magnified material, literally the best material in the game. That's so good that the creators only give you one of it the entire game. At least in the uh, original one. Yeah, that shit's so fucking good. All right. Uh, I think we're good then, right? We've done, except for Chadley's research, but can I uh, meet Solon? Sonon? Is that possible? I can bring him to help me with this because I'm pretty sure Yuffie's going to have a hard time doing this by herself. Huh? Oh, he's having me right behind me. Ah, there you are. Someone's been expecting you. What took you? Sorry about that. 
What? Just thinking how you're nothing like your old man. <laughs> anyway, it's nice to meet you. I'm Sonon Kasakabe. Oh no, he's hot! Yeah, I don't want to talk about him. Let's talk about something else. Like how you've adjusted to life here. Indulging in adult pastimes. <laughs> Which I guess means drinking yourself stupid. <laughs> Last thing I need is my partner stinking like an over the hill has been. Speaking of drinking, you been to the Happy Turtle? If you're part of Operation Down in One, I take it back. I am there next time you go. Don't worry, I can do adult stuff just fine. Well, I don't even know where to begin with all of that. But I do know I haven't heard of Operation Down in One. At any rate, I'm looking forward to working with you, boss. Boss? <laughs> As in me? Well, I've got a few years on you, I'll admit. But out of us two, you've done this longer. I... I guess I have. Uh-oh. It's gonna, yes, gonna go right to your head. I could get used to that. Beats being stuck on the bottom rung, that's for sure. <laughs> After we get the materia, we can celebrate your promotion at the Happy Turtle. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh god. Stupid bird. It says the merchandise is good to go. Handoff's at a depot and municipal storage. Okay. Yuffie, Sonon, you mind coming along? Not at all. Need to scope out the city anyway. Really get to know the enemy. We'll be passing through a rough part of town, so you'll want to go prepared. I'll leave you to get ready. Hit me up outside when you're done, okay? Be right there. Sonon Kusakabe. Wow, so this guy's totally new. He was not in any of the original game. I have no idea who the fuck this guy is. Cool design, though. I do like... He's got, like, this kind of, like, Genji armor plates around his arms and his shoulders. And, of course, he's smoking hot! And he's got kind of like a... What looks like the, like the Monkey King pole on his back. Cool. I wonder... Can I control him? Can I, like, switch to him in, in battle? Um, okay, so I got more HP than she does. Marshalless staff. Just wow, you do not have many fucking materia slots. Uh, a simple, easy to wield staff uh, used in Wataian tra training exercises. Strike a foe a myriad of times, dealing a large amount of damage. Swirling storm. Holy shit. <sighs> oh my god, so sick looking. Use it to finish off an enemy. Uh, what's he got equipped? Item master, auto cure. First strike, provoke. Automatically use provoke to temporarily draw the enemy's attention when teammates are severely injured and effective against powerful enemies. Will not activate the player is controlling the character. He definitely seems to set up to be your support, right? Hold on, let me go. Uh, let me go practice with Sonon here a little bit. Get a feel for how he works before I uh, attempt Ramu. <laughs> I just like said, this song is like I think they're saying I want to get wrecked at the motherfucking Happy Turtle. Want to suck a dick at a motherfucking turtle. Fight along with Sonon. You cannot control Sonon in combat. Ah. Instead, issue commands to him using R2. L2 will have him synergize with Yuffie, and he will team up with her to perform attacks in tandem. Uh, L2 to press. Try pressing L2 to synergize your team. Uh, synergized attacks. Uh, oh, I didn't even look at what it said. The next page there. Yuffie and Sonon synergized attacks make uh, enemies susceptible to staggering or highly effective against pressure foes. When both Yuffie and Sonon have ATB charges available, they can perform synergized versions of a number of her abilities. Of their abilities. Note that Sonon's ATB gauge fills up more slowly when he is synergized. Press L2 again to disengage. What the hell? Oh, finish synergizing. Okay. Oh shit! Wow! Oh my god! We're... Oh my god! This is so sick. So while I'm attacking, he's just like flying around me. Okay, give him commands. Uh, oh, he's actually got another move: twirling, twirling lunge. It's set up upon a foe while spinning. Significantly increases stagger. All right, let's do this one. Nice. None can escape the wrath of the ninja. Want to overreact a little more? <laughs> I like this guy already. Wow, cool, man. I was kind of like, oh, I can't control him, but then it, it's, this synergizing thing is super sick. 
it's interesting. It does kind of make me a little nervous about what's going to happen to this guy. Because, like I said, he did not show up in the original Final Fantasy VII. I mean, it could be, well, you know, different timelines or whatever the fuck is going on in this game, right? Could answer that. But I do think there's a distinct possibility that something's going to happen with him at the end of this, right? But I'm not exactly sure what. Does he die? Does he run off? Did he potentially churn on us? I, I don't know. I don't know exactly why he wouldn't be with us when we meet Cloud eventually. Or it could be he does stick around with us and he just like is it's just something that wasn't in the original game, but we're already seeing the difference between now and then. So, you know, maybe there's some like timeline reason why he would show up this time, but not the last time. Clearly he knows Yuffie's father too. I'm guessing they must be friends or something. Damn, that move does actually a fuck ton of damage. Rocking out with my brass bro soda. We're gonna go to Happy Turtle. Gonna get some pussy. Yeah. <laughs> Can I uh, share a spot for me there? Nope. My bitch. Mine. Very professional Yuffie. All right. Let's go see if we can uh, fuck up Ramu now. It's probably the reason why he doesn't have too many slots is because it's gonna be hard to get him to do magic and stuff. I mean, you can, but he's kind of been be doing mostly his own thing or synergizing with you. I wonder if he'll get many other weapons though. I think also just the fact that I can't control him either seems kind of weird to me, you know? Also an indication that he won't be around in like the, when the full game comes, you know? Oh God. Of course he just had to go for me, huh? Ah! Let's go the fuck in. Ah! Ah! Take this, you motherfucker. Oh, fuck. Sonos dead. Shit. Sonos, stop fighting. Oh, God. Uh oh. Uh oh. Balls. Okay. I kind of was just going Unga McBunga. See, I was going doing doing well until we died. Oh wait, 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 wait. Yeah, shut up, shut up, shut, shut the fuck up. No, no. I didn't upgrade his weapon. What do you have? Attack plus five, magic plus five, defense plus six, magic defense plus six, max HP plus a hundred. Incendiary limit breaks. What? New materia slot. Fuck is incendiary limit breaks. He really does need some more material slots, though. Fills limit break gauge when inciting or provoking enemies. Really? That's interesting. Sure, that's kind of a cool one. Uh, material slot, definitely. And that's all I can afford. Should we want to consider buying some, some more armor for him? A more slots. Yeah, I'm guessing he's probably not going to be really using moves on his own either, though. I kind of have to direct him. So things like deadly dodge or parry are probably not going to be any use to him. God, the load times in this version of the game, they were insane. Like, seriously, when I loaded my game up today, it was, like, just so fast, I couldn't believe it. All right, let's try, uh, twirling lunch. Uh-oh. There we go. She used block more often with her. All right, wind. Oh shit, I hit the thing. Oh boy. Da -na -da -na -na -na. I feel like the synergizing thing might be good when you stagger an opponent. Oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna die! Oh god! What the hell is he doing some shit? Oh, he did! He did some shit and then killed, killed himself for me! Oh god! Oh my god. Oh my god, it's just getting fucking insane. What the hell? Gotta break the sparks! No, 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 I got stunned! No! <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Why is this boss so insane? What a shame. Shut up, Chadley, and just throw me back in there. Yo, this boss fight's kind of nuts. Oh, shit! I can... What the fuck? The perfect block actually made her immune. 
Then again, I also have flat fast block on, which might have helped with that. And it gave me... Oh, and I have barrier, too. That's right. When I do this, it gives me barrier. Holy shit, that was so sick. It was so... That actually looked really cool, too. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Fuck you, dude. Okay. Here comes this move. Let's see if I can stagger him, though. Come on. Oh, my God. He's turned that shit into a mace. What the fuck? Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Go in. Yeah! Ah, go crazy! Ah. Wait. Ah, shit him with the, that one. I was when he was fucking staggered. Ah, fuck it though. Ah, oh, he's dead. Doesn't matter. He's fucking dead. Fuck you, Ramu. Give me your demon power. Thanks to the data you provided during your battle, I succeeded in developing a new materia. One might say you were faster than lightning. Chop Charlie. And with the Lord of Levin on your side, your enemies will struggle to keep up. Sick. I will take it. Invoke Ramu to aid you in battle. With the power of lightning. Huh, Sona can actually get it too. All right, I think, I think we're good to go. To whatever the next thing is. Damn it, the fighting in this game is so much fucking fun. You guys all set? Ready to go. Okay, streets are kind of a maze, so stay close. So now, where are we headed? To pick up your IDs. There's no way to get topside without them. But I thought TJ was getting our high Ds. What happened to High that? Ds. He is, but those are different. It takes more than one ID, or even two, to survive in this town. Don't forget, Midgar was built by Shinra for Shinra. Those tyrants! Put the claws away, boss. At least while we're in Shinra territory. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Why did he just go, whoa? <laughs> so, Yuffie, what do you think of the Undercity? Way too crowded. I can't stand it. Ugh, and the stench. How can anyone live here? I gotta agree with you about the smell, but you get used to it quick enough. And the crowds stop bothering you eventually. The place can grow on you if you give it a chance. Uh, wait a second. Are you actually saying you like it here? I thought you hated it. Midgar isn't the enemy. Shinra is. I know W's don't really see the distinction, but we do. Um, what was that stuff on the news? About a reactor blowing up and all. No way, that was an accident. It had to be Avalanche. Shh, sorry. God, you've got such a big mouth. Uh, what's up? Those guys there are from the Splinter Hey, there they are! Splinter Cell? They used to be with Avalanche, but left after a policy dispute. Wow, look who it is. Loving your work. So how many reactors is that now? Wait, where's Cloud? Fucking dead. We lost him. You what? He will be okay though, right? Well, of course he will. A little fall ain't gonna stop a hard ass like him. He got shit to steal. He'll come swaggering back before long. You mark my words. Yeah, I guess he will. Now, can we talk about President Shithead? Spouting all that crap about us? That lying son of a bitch! Working for Wu Tai? Avalanche ain't nobody! Barrett! Oh. <laughs> Speaking of big mouth. Speaking of sons of bitches, I heard that Walmart's very own Don Corneo has his stooges out looking for you. Huh? Is that so? Oh, don't got time for no low-level mobs. God, this fucking music, dude. We got Shinra in our sights. Frickin' Tifa's theme. They have like 30 different versions of it, and they're all amazing. You and I both know this is far from over, right? Might as well get some rest while we still can. Right. Hmm. Tifa sad. You know what? I think I am gonna look into this. Hmm. Good luck out there. They're the ones who blew up the reactor. <laughs> I think that's like important happening. Oh, should we say hi? No, 
better not. Nah, can't so disrupt the space time time continuum here. Assume Shinra's on their tail. Fucking Plakus won't let you anyway. My thoughts exactly. <laughs> Curse you, Plot Ghost. I love the design of Sonon's weapon. It's so cool looking. The people in the splinter cell, they couldn't care less about collateral damage. As long as Shinra goes down. So what's wrong with that? Sounds good to me. We're not out to blow Midgar up or tear it down. We want to save it from Shinra. Look around. Nine out of ten of the people living here are innocent bystanders. We can't level their home to take down one company. Well, that company almost leveled our home. And they've got to learn their lesson. Yeah, I get that. Gotta admit, I'm surprised you agreed to work with us. We're just doing what we think is necessary to build a brighter future. That's all there is to it. In other words, you're working with us so we don't work with your old buddies, knowing what would happen if we did. Uh, can we table this for later, maybe? Not sure now's the best time for heavy topics. Yeah, couldn't agree more. Mm. Consider it tabled. Interesting. So it's like, I mean, old buddies probably meant like Baron crew, right? Because... I guess, are we considered the more extreme group? I thought the other group was. Although, no, I guess we are. We're the ones that are blowing everything up. So, what exactly does this ultimate materia do? I'm guessing yeah, you have big Yeah, really? For what it? is this shit? Like after we steal it? Well, the more materia you is have, it real? the stronger you are, right? So once we've got the ultimate materia, we'll be stronger than anyone. I guess you will. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome. <laughs> and not just that. By sneaking into Shinra HQ and snatching their most prized possession from under their noses, not only will we deal a massive blow to their morale, but we'll prove to them that while Wu Tai might be down, we're not out. Is that the gist of it, boss? It sure is. <laughs> yeah, Wu Tai's been a big focus in this game, way more than in the original. <laughs> well, hello there, hot stuff. How'd you like a shot at the big town? <laughs> Boom! Boom! Looks like Finger guns! <laughs> <laughs> so what do you say? Ready to be queen of the undercity? Oh, God. Hey! What am I? Chopped liver? <laughs> Kid doesn't need to hear this. You'll be a good girl and cover your ears, okay? You'd be living and working in the most luxurious residence in all you of the world. You want me to be one of Cornelia's brides, is that it? Which makes you a person of influence, right? Oh, so you know your stuff. But I'd the say fuck is this music, dude? Helping hand. So why don't you help me help you? <laughs> Let's get going. What are you doing? Get your hands off me. <laughs> now don't go playing hard. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Drop kick! <laughs> no any kids who can do that? No, you don't. Because I'm an adult. <laughs> I'm an adult! <laughs> I'm pretty hot stuff myself. Threw it on the ground. Much. Sure. Whatever helps you sleep at night, little girl. Oh, fuck, let's go. Uh, if you want to pull up a seat at the grown-ups table, be my guest. I'll show you what true demon power is, you little assholes. Woo! <laughs> what did you say now, huh, motherfucker? What are you going to say now? Yeah. What in the fuck? The music is going in. What? No, 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 no. God, I feel like I'm listening to that, uh, that Final Fantasy X song. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's metal as fuck. Don Corneo's underlings on the hunt for the most beautiful woman in the, under in the Undercity. They're always ready for a fight. And always, and all, ha all have their own weapon of choice. Oh, yeah, they do. You guys got a gun. Let's go. Oh, that's right. Actually, they said that uh, going like this actually does increase your uh, the pressure you do, too. Uh oh no, other guy. Sword on Drew's the enemy's attention. Well, I fucking heal. Oh yeah. I need more ammo, dude. What the fuck? Oh, 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 synergized art of war. Fuck, let's go. Oh, 
sick. Let's do it. Let's do. Uh, oh wait, are we not? We're not synergizing anymore. Oh wait, yeah, we are. I think. Yeah, we were. What? Why can't I do another one? Did I have to be like maxed out? Oh no, he needs to have ATB. Oh shit. I got you, dude. What? Oh, come on, dude. Seriously? Must have been literally like milliseconds before he fucking got that heal. Sonar does have his own limit break, too. Chthonian armlet. Hey, I miss you, Tron. You're gonna eat those words, you smug piece of shit. Boss, huh? boss, you're not gonna believe this. Hmm? The hottie of the century just fell right into our lap. She did? <laughs> yeah! She under the hood, junk in the trunk, oh, and down for a bumpy ride. Uh... Oh, God. Sorry, ladies, but after careful consideration, <laughs> she also beats your ass. Qualified applicant. <laughs> See you around. Yeah! <laughs> music, dude. He's like, uh, well, uh, I guess that's it. So who were those creeps anyway? Don Corneo's talent scouts. They'll say and do just about anything. Uh, so we're actually gonna go all the way over here now. We didn't actually. I thought it looked seedy. Guess you'd have to be a scumbag to build a place like that. Oh ho! And how do you know what it looks like? I saw it when I was scouting the area. Right, scouting. <laughs> we didn't actually go uh back here before. We went as far as that spot over there where Cloud threatened that guard. Well, we're here. Now we just have to wait. Wait for who? Not sure. We used to have someone who could make fake IDs in house, but they went off with the splinter cell. We've oh. never dealt with this particular vendor before. I think it's Jesse, right? Hmm. <sighs> hey, uh, what's up? Another one of them. Mako poisoning. That's what happens if you don't make the grade as a soldier. Or when the military's done using you. Then you go full goth. Just another one of Shinra's victims. Them again? Oh, Shinra's so gonna get it. If it's Shinra, uh -huh. you've got beef. Uh -huh. You'll be needing these. Can't access the plate without them. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> They're gonna scan for those things on the train, so make sure to keep them on you. Thank you. Hey, hold up. Try it. You'll love it. <laughs> Foreigners and their weak jaws. We should probably head back and wait for GG. He's like, what the fuck, dude? Why? <laughs> Enjoy your material while you still can, Shinra. Because we're coming. Not yet, boss. Huh? With things the way they are, we can't just go strolling up to the front gates. We're gonna need Avalanche to help us bypass security before we can do anything. Aww. But a You okay, bro? Yeah. Reunion. Good talk, man. Sore. Uh, Kindred Court. Oh, yeah, I also got a... Uh, Thonian armlet grants pre-natural strength when paired with accessories Gozu Drive or Mezu Drive. Really? Uh, I don't think I have that. Wait, do I? Kindred Cord, no. Reduces ATB gauss for synergized abilities? Ooh, really? That sounds pretty good. I'll blow this shit up. Ah! These fucking birds, dude. What the hell? Oh. What's this about? Bird up. Change of plans. Go to the pillar. We'll explain there. Hurry. GG. Huh? Change of plans? The S7 pillar? Otherwise known as the roof of the slums. Follow me, guys. Huh. Why does he need us to hurry? I don't know what the sound of this. Well, if you ask me, it's high time things picked up around here. You like living in the fast lane, huh? Yeah, I'm not your garden variety, Wu Tian. 
I'm a rare bloom. More like a mutant. Ooh, I'm so gonna use that. Did you make that well, it's way too soon for the the pillar to come coming to come crashing down. So, I'm not exactly sure what this would be. That's Gigi. You're right. Hold up. Hey, I'm talking to you. Answer me. Well, look, a Moogle. Stop. We gotta help. You two go after Gigi. I'll head back and tell the others what happened. That way. Boss, we might not be back for a while. Let's just stock up before leaving. Do you have any idea what Gigi actually did? Whatever it was, he probably did it for us. Well, now I feel bad. No time for that, boss. Right. Let's go, baby. Oh, damn, we're going to the train graveyard? I think we are. Oh, I think I see a purple chest. Oh, yeah, baby. Endurance staff. Uh, someone learned this one yet. Fighting spirit. A battle staff capped with iron ingots, heavy enough to shatter bone. Continue targeting a single enemy to deal increased damage. Wow, really? Holy shit. That sounds really good. Shit. You got nowhere to run. Tell us what you know. Now! <laughs> How about later? That's stupid. <sighs> oh, shit. Hey! Damn, these guys suck. Oh, talk about fast. Is he one of us? We don't have time to get into that, boss. You can ask him yourself once he's safe. Come on. What in the world? Things that go up and down? Is it, whoa! Yeah, I guess it is. And take this to go back up again. One's right over here. Okay, yeah, this is definitely uh, not the trim graveyard. Chris J. Oh, God, the music. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, violent aggressive. These nocturnal carnivores hunt for prey in packs and will not hesitate to attack humans. Uh. Rolling storm. Don't pull any punches. No, wasn't planning on it. Sick. God damn, man. It's just so much fucking fun. Stopped in a convenient place. Got a lot of uh, new music here, too. I like how the, the theme, too, that's been playing with Yuffie is actually is a combination of the Wu-Tai theme and her theme. It's so, it's so fucking good. So clever. Uh, okay, we go that way, and then... I think up is where I need to go. All right, throwing storm learned. Chakra leveled up. Yeah, it's leveling up chakra fucking fast. Oh god. Thank you. Seriously, man, what the fuck? Why is the music in this same so game so godlike? Fucking jazzy beats. There's like such a variety too. Sweeper. Okay, let's switch over to uh endurance endurance staff. What upgrades does this have? Uh just some basic stuff. Two attack power pluses. 
max HP, max MP, max, uh, max attack power. Okay, it's actually mostly an attack power uh, weapon anyway. Go with the HP and more attack. Up we go. What up, guys? Sorry. Damn. Damn. We should radio the other squads. Been looking for you. The hell? Not today, guys. Elite Troopers. Okay, these are the same guys we fought in the original game. So long, get in there and smack them. Focusing down that enemy. Okay, I'm fucked up. Oh, well, he's dead. Uh, oh, we got some stuff over here. And so I leveled up his weapons. Oh, they're lesser drakes. You come here, mister. Yeah. Get him, Sonon. Wonder how good Sonon is with air enemies. Uh-oh. Uh, looks like he might be struggling a bit. Kill him, Sonon. Okay, get him, get him, get him, get him. There we go. Get that fishing bonus. All right, focus down that one now. Auto cure material leveled up. Provoke material leveled up. Nice. We really funny, Sonon. I said that along with her. Well, that was, uh, that was unexpected. Ooh, a prayer, prayer material. That's a good shit. Give it to Sonon. CG dude, you can stop running, man. We got him. Oh, uh, did I pass it already? Look, like I've already gone everywhere. Oh, was it actually back over this way? I said to trigger it. Oh, no, here it is. Yeah, there we are. God, the fucking drums, man, this song. It's got such a beat to it. Damn. Beat slaps. Ugh. Yeah. Uh. Any booty around here? No? Aside from Sonon's booty. Oh! You think is you not? I wonder how old Sonon's supposed to be. Uh. Operate the conveyor belt. Wait. Let's go. Boxes. Hey, More boxes. She's local, remember? She'll be fine. You know, she's actually pretty cool. I feel bad saying this, but after what happened back home, I just kind of assumed no one in Avalanche could be trusted. Like they were all the same as the ones I fought. Yeah, I can imagine. But it looks like Avalanche has changed a lot since that went down. Huh? Hmm. Run, soldier dudes, run! Damn, they're still chasing him. You guys just don't know when to quit. Oh boy. Double time. Ooh, yeah. What the? That's a big horn. That's a big crispy. A unique variety of crisp shea that's particularly large, ferocious, and rap rapacious compared to others of its kind. 
When it locates its potential prey, it will command other crypt shades to pounce on en masse. Ow! Time for the ice shit. Let's go. What the hell? Oh god, he's some friends! Heart of War! Ah! Oh my god, he's healing himself doing that. Level up! Weapon level up! Hey, Gozu Drive. There we go. So if that one thing is combined with uh, Gozu Drive, only effective when Catholian, uh, Catholian armlet is equipped. Increases damage dealt proportional to character's current HP. Damn. Okay. Sounds like that could be quite good. Hey, got a new node for the four-point shuriken. Uh, attack power, match power, max MP, bloodsucker, precision defense ATB boost, and new materia slot. Did I have precision defense on this one? No, the other one. So this one will give me AT boost if I defend at the right time. Cover HP when enemies are defeated. That is good. Yeah, guarding attack at the right time will fill the ATB gauge. That's pretty dope. Yeah, I got to remember I can also do that. I got a free, uh, basically a free barrier on mine. Uh, it's got to be a new node, right? Yeah. Uh, attack power, match power, uh, trade off. Attack spells, uh, MP cost reduction 20% and precision defense man award. Oh, shit. I could actually get a barrier and man award if I get a a good uh, good defense. Damn, that's actually pretty sick. Uh, recover MP when receiving significant damage. Yeah, that's actually uh, quite good. I'm actually gonna yeah, I'm gonna save for that one. Ooh, another weapon. Steel Reaper. Well, this weapon looks fucking dope. An exceptionally deadly weapon crafted from three scythe blades. Holy shit. Banishment. ATB spent on other commands increases damage dealt. Affinity changes with an injutsu. Works in the air. Wait, what? Proficiency bonus. Strike an enemy with maximum strength while this ability is at level three. I'm not sure if I understand what this even means. So if I spend ATB on other skills that aren't this, it's going to power up what this is this can do and then I unleash it? I don't even know what level it is though. Maybe I'll tell you in the fight or something. Okay, we got a new material slot. Let's just get it. Oh, interesting. Another precision defense regen. And theory again. Uh, weapon ability critical hit 10% boost. Yeah, I'll take that. All right. Let's give it a shot. Wall run? Yeah. <laughs> it's just that easy. <laughs> Absolutely no momentum lost. says they've got the suspect detained near pillar maintenance. We better not keep them waiting. What? Dude, seriously, this music slaps fucking hard. How'd they let him get that? Well, if I know. Come on. You were hiking there. Wait, hey, boss, no. <laughs> Freeze! <laughs> Whoops. Is that guy dead? Oh shit, I didn't even get a chance to scan him. I was striking some AP, dude. God, I gotta die so fast. Oh, it does. It does tell you. Oh god, here comes the thing. Shit. Should lay on that immediately. So, uh, did that bring it up a level? Did it? Fuck it. Ah, die. I like how she's the option to actually just grab the switch with her hand, but she still whacks over their fucking shuriken. No! <laughs> Gotta look cool! Always! Cloud's like, that's my mantra. Hasn't failed me yet. I actually wonder if Yuvi's gonna keep this Moogle laughing on the whole, the whole, uh, 
DLC. Storage Depot. It's a big ass place, dude. Oh, more wall, more wall, yeah, more wall running. And climbing. <laughs> That's kind of clever. Wee! See that massive structure up ahead? That's the pillar those troopers were talking about. Assuming the maintenance facilities here in the area should probably get toward it. Sound good? Yeah, works for me. Come on. Make a wall. Oh, I just realized she's actually grabbed. She's literally grabbing this. Okay, that's that's why she's able to run so easily. She's literally holding the pole and and going across like that. C gotcha. I was like, how is she doing that? I thought it was just anime reasons. There we go. I got it already. Damn it, you think? It's not that complicated. It's Doom Rats. Ah. There we go. So that, yeah. So you looks like you actually level up to level six potentially. Ah. I need a long fight to be able to do that. <laughs> I'm liking their dynamic. Oh, Assassin Board three. Did I already have that one? No, no, I didn't actually. Hmm. I wonder if this is still going to be actually more uh, for Condor. I kind of figured I was done with it at this point, but maybe not. In fact, I'm still getting pieces, and I'm seemingly not going to be able to go back, I didn't think. Oh, God, it's this diesel thing. Whoa, where's my camera looking? Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, resolve mystery, ability, hissing drugs. Yes, this is the diesel puppy that uh, Cloud and Tifa went after at one point. Wait a minute. Does my- this shit still carries over? What? I haven't used an ability yet, this fight. Does it? It does. What the hell? That's kind of funky. I mean, I used the ability though already. I kind of figured it would drain it after I'd used it. Oh god, this thing's pissed. There we go. I guess it- oh, I guess, I guess it only spends it once it's actually full here. Uh, ATB spent another command. Okay, max level 3. Works in the air. Let's give it a try. Oh, I see, and it changes based on what my affinity is. That's wow, that's actually really cool. Okay, that was that, that was actually not max level. That brought up to level two. Then I can go to level three. I got you. Yeah, that's actually cool though that it carries over even if I if I haven't actually gotten to that max form yet. I like how our moves synergize so much with. God damn, this move really jungles, guys. But they synergize with her uh, ninjutsu. Uh, now what? Oh. Oh, clever. Oh, down. Over. So the dog goes again. Oh, God. Help me, son. Oh, it's over. Holy shit. What the fuck? Son, help me. Damn. That'll do it. So what you think? Aren't I just awesome? God, I can't wait actually to see once Yuffie gets into the party with Cloud and teams, hearing them talk with each other. Hmm. Interesting. They're all just really good people, huh? They're too soft. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, that was that was a slight look into his character, wasn't it? Ooh. Ooh. I I actually am seeing this could potentially turn into a. Uh, a backstab or a problem down down the line between him and her. I mean, yeah, they, I mean, technically, Clout and team is, you know, that's our group, but I mean, they stop blowing up reactors and they move on to other things. Uh, wow, okay, this is starting to get a little more complicated. Uh, I guess we'll go this way. Oh, shit, I see some blue, blue stuff. 
Hmm. Okay. So this will get me this side. Getting back over there is going to be... Oh, oh. Get up there. Yeah. Maybe? Actually, this is good. more complicated. This is getting a bit more complicated here. Okay, yeah. So go this way. Oh, I can reach it down here. And then... I think the key to this is now going upward. Yes. <laughs> wow, that's kind of cool. Uh, anything else up here? Oh no, what the hell did I just... Oh no, I didn't see it! No! Oh fuck, can I, can I go back? Oh, I can. Okay, cool. <laughs> I was like looking all upward and I just had to run to that pole. Damn, this is a surprisingly large area. I thought it was just going to be like a small little like run through, but no, this is a uh, extensive area here. Always got to prioritize the blue stuff. Always. All right, what we got? Uh, elemental Bateria. That yeah, makes sense. We hadn't got one of those yet. Oh, wait. No, I uh, definitely don't want to do that. So I want to stay over here. Yeah, actually, this really gives you kind of like some jazzy cowboy bebop vibes. This song. Do, 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 Waste disposal plant. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Speaking of. A little late for that. Is that a cockatrice or something? <laughs> oh my god, do you remember? Oh my god, I remember this bird. I remember this fucking, this is the bird kick bird. That I made an inside joke, well, one of the inside jokes I had with one of my friends. With Ice Pick. We play through this game. It's literally bur This is just a regular enemy on the map out in the world map. Now he's diesel as shit. Oh god, bird kick. Oh, looks like he's got some new moves here. Uh, a large bird found in the under city, capable of attacking with its iron-like bill. It has evolved to use its formidable wings as hands to seize potential prey. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know if I remember having hands. Uh, fire ice. Let's go fire because I haven't done that yet. Okay, uh... Get him! What the fuck? He's got... Oh my god, this is some Monster Hunter bullshit! He's grabbing a rock? Oh god! And it's blocking my attacks, potentially? Alright, fire. Burn, you dick! Yeah, that's right. Wait, oh god, he just gave himself haste? I think he did. Art of War! Ow. Is that all you got? Take this. Ah! Mezu Drive! Oh, yeah, that fucking man award thing. That's gonna make this one super dope. Hey, new note for the Marshalist uh, staff. Attack power, match power, max HP, attack damage, 5%, new material slot. His isn't art super exciting, I will say. He's got some pretty basic shit. Up we go. God damn, man, look at this lighting. Fuck. Why is this game so fucking gorgeous? Stop it. How dare you? Oh, hey. Oh, a note from Zizi. Uh, conveyor belt passes through storage. Break containers with shuriken. Screw over Shinra. Get to it. Jot it down hastily. Oh, right. I got also got a new uh, uh, accessory. So the Mezu drive. Uh, I'm virtually proportional to the character's cr uh, current MP. It's like HP would be just better, right? Though it's, well, because generally HP is much larger, but eh, probably not. Okay, I think I've been going for a while now. I Again, just like before, it's fucking hard to stop playing this game is so addicting and fucking 
God dang it, man. It's so engaging. Like, what the fuck? Like, like I said, this guy over here is brand new, and I'm already, like, super into their dynamic, and uh, we're already starting to get a little bit of a glimpse of his character with what he was saying to her. But all the dialogue and everything is so natural and so well-written. And this music, man, what the fuck? Gameplay, dude. Even just, like, the fact, if I can't control him directly, just, like, being able to, like, do stuff together like that is super cool. Um... But anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode as much as I did. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite and subscribe if you're not already become Piggy Penguin. Aboard this sail be where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy.